So how do I hike with your heart? That's a remarkable question and one that I can't wait to tell you more about. So we're encouraging people to collect donations online. There's multiple ways that you can do that. And we will be sharing our landing page website with you. So at some point, you should see that pop up in the chat. And in that, uh, on that landing page, it's kidsave.org slash hike. 2021, on that landing page, you will see all of the different information going on about the event, the different apps that you can use to fundraise, all the ways that you can get engaged and excited about this event will all be right there for you. So, and then there's also uh, a portion of that is activity challenges. So even if, you know, fundraising, you're feeling a little challenged by that and you want to get a little bit more information, maybe just get outside and get exercising and kind of challenge yourself and some friends. That's a great opportunity to get started. And so we encourage you to join that and we'll be having some prizes and things. We'll tell you more about that and the incentives just coming up. Okay, so the virtual hike. This is awesome. I wanna actually take a minute to stop here and I'm gonna share a video with you because I think this is gonna be more helpful for you as we um go through and it'll really illustrate the kind of impact that we're trying to have with hike and how this can look for you so essentially what we're doing is we're encouraging everyone to participate and fundraise and then the week of the event we'll be sending you information for how to get to this and how to download this app onto your phone so you can participate on the 18th the best part is is you can run you can walk you can meander it is a hike after all you might find something beautiful and need to stop and take a picture so meandering is absolutely encouraged um you can hit the running portion you can just join in and listen in so if maybe you have to do the hike on a different day if you're like the 18th doesn't work for me yet that's totally okay so we absolutely encourage you to think through those elements but listen in with us on that day and do what is best for you so you don't have to be uh, outside hiking with us you can join just because you're maybe at the house getting some errands done doing some things and you just want to join in with us we want our community together it's really important so let's show you some more <laughs> What's so awesome about this is it's I'm seeing folks who who in the earlier you know events were, were starting off a little slow maybe they wanted to pace themselves and I say slow not because it was slow but just slow because hey they're they're burning their own pace or whatever they're doing but it, it feels like you know it really feels like the energy is going to fuel some great great whether the, whether you're the marking a PR or not it feels like we're going to have some good times turned in because oh. I, I think they can see they can see the end of this puppy uh, look you're a do-gooder don't forget that you get to now carry that like a mantra uh, a billboard over your head and let's not forget the do good that's happening for our charity partners like kids save our final shout out for kids save it's actually a request and, uh, and that is just to consider becoming a kids save family we've been yakking in your ear for the last two days five five k's about this organization you sure as heck have an idea of how beneficial they are in the foster care space. Maybe it's not you, but maybe it's somebody you know. And what a great way to introduce that conversation, to have that dialogue. Guess what I did for good this weekend? And this organization, Kids Save, is really, really worth it. We, we need mentors for them, foster care, adoption services. It's all available to you at kidsave.org. Okay, excellent. So that's it. That's 
you know, what a virtual hike is going to be like. And you're like, okay, well, that's an app. So what other parts of engagement are we talking about? Well, what we're really saying is get out to your local park. Go find a state park, a local, a regional park. It doesn't matter. Shoot, if you're like, ah, I'm not really much of a hiking person, go out to your local sidewalks. I happen to live near Santa Monica. I would gladly listen in with this Kids Aid community and do my walk on the Santa Monica boardwalk. I am going to be doing it from Kenneth Hound Park on the 25th. Be there, be square. But this is what we want. So get to that local park. Get connected through um, the cell phone provider in that area and just plug your headphones in. Or if you're with your family, put that phone on speaker so everyone can listen and enjoy. You can be texting the whole time. You can be listening to what's going on. You can track your mileage with the charge app so you'll know exactly how long your hike was over that 60 minutes. And it's just a great way to get engaged and to do it in a way that allows our community to be together audially right? It's like a podcast, but you can join us from anywhere. There's no boundaries. And that's the best part. And that's really what we want for Hike With Your Heart. We don't want there to be anything standing in between you and us and a remarkable hike experience. So we really hope that uh, this encourages you and excites you. I know it excites me. Uh, and we can't wait to hear you and see you as you're out in these beautiful places on the 18th.